So you want to make a dubstep on and soundtrack. That's pretty easy. Well, first you need to open a new track, obviously. First you need first you need to uh, select guitar basses and select Red 808 because that's the only that's the only uh that's the only bass it works on. Now you want to add distortion. Okay, so first you need classic distortion. Uh, what you want to do is max that out. Now we'll come back to the now we'll come back to the distortion in a minute. Next you're gonna put the rate in the uh, in the middle, like uh, like an off centered middle, uh, like off centered, but you don't notice it. Next you want to have this almost maxed out. You want to have def almost maxed out, and then and then phaser. Um, you're gonna add you're gonna have to add phaser, then have this almost maxed out as well. It's gonna have a rate mixed out as well. Then have def. Uh, you're gonna have def point to the volume. Next, you're gonna uh, have classic. Dis you're gonna put in classic distortion again. Um, maxed out distort. Maxed out distortion, but don't, um, but don't max out. But but don't uh, but not but do not max out uh tone. Put uh, you're gonna put you're gonna put it in. Uh, you're gonna put it in off center middle, but, but pointing almost down. Like, uh, like it should look like this. Next, you're gonna get. Next, you're gonna put in overdrive. You're gonna. Uh, you're gonna put distortion down a bit, and it's and the same goes for tone also. Next, you're gonna add an uh, an an equalizer. And I don't normally add equalizers in my uh, songs, but uh, but this is highly recommended if you want. Uh, if you if you want the if you want the best results next you're going to add a uh, compressor one now i don't add a comp i don't i don't usually add compressors in my in my songs just 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 uh just only a, just only a only a bit of a portion I actually want to uh, add a volume rocker because it's not gonna sound. It's not gonna sound very loud. Next, you're gonna add a brighter. Now don't um. Now keep it where. Now keep it where it's at. And the next final two are, uh, are, are, are another volume, and another, and uh, another brighter. It should sound like this. <laughs> It should sound like that. Now, uh, now one major drawback of, uh, of this is uh, now one major drawback is that is is that it is that because of the compress because of the two of compressed because of the compressor. <laughs> You can't you can't fade it you can't fade in or out. So my recommendation use automation. Like see when you try uh, we try to fade it out. All it does is muffle. It doesn't uh, it doesn't fade out. So the only the only option is to f uh, is to fade it out by automation. I don't know that's not good quality fading out, but but it's good until I can find a better solution. What's even cool is that you can even play around with it. Pretty cool. So yeah, that's it.